Ever wondered how honeydew pineapples and bamboo shoots are harvested and brought to the market? Well, you're in for a treat. Today, we delve into the intricate process of harvesting these common yet fascinating agricultural products. Understanding the harvesting process is not just for farmers, but for anyone who enjoys these delightful fruits and vegetables. It gives us a deeper appreciation of the work that goes into delivering these products from the farm to our tables. We're going to take you on a journey that starts in the lush fields where these crops grow. We'll walk you through the life cycle of honeydew pineapples and bamboo shoots, show you the precise moment when they're ripe for picking and how they're carefully harvested to ensure the best quality. Then, we'll guide you through the journey these products take to reach the market, ready for you to enjoy. So, stay tuned to learn about the step-by-step -step process of harvesting and selling these popular products. Now let's dive into the world of honeydew pineapples. One of the unique aspects of honeydew pineapples is their life cycle, which starts with the planting of a seed. This seed, once nurtured in the right conditions, begins its journey to become a fully grown pineapple plant. The process is fascinating and it all begins in the soil. The seeds are planted in nutrient-rich soil, preferably in a warm climate. Pineapples thrive best in temperatures between 68 and 86 degrees Fahrenheit with a good amount of sunlight and well-drained soil. After planting, the waiting game begins. It takes about two to three weeks for the seeds to germinate and sprout tiny green shoots. These shoots then grow into seedlings, which are transplanted into the field after about one to two months. Once in the field, the pineapple plants require careful tending. They need to be watered regularly, but not excessively, as pineapples don't like to have wet feet. The plants also need protection from pests and diseases, which can significantly affect their growth and the quality of the fruit. After about 12 to 18 months, the pineapple plants start to flower. Each plant produces a single flower, which eventually develops into a pineapple. The flowering stage is a critical time as it determines the size and quality of the fruit. The fruit then takes about six months to ripen. As it ripens, the pineapple changes color from green to yellow, giving it the characteristic honeydew shade. It also develops its unique sweet and tangy flavor during this time. Throughout the life cycle of the honeydew pineapple, it's essential to maintain the right balance of watering, sunlight, and pest control. This is the secret to growing a successful crop. Once the pineapples ripen, it's time for the harvest. This is when the months of hard work and patience finally pay off as the ripe pineapples are picked and prepared for the market, ready to be enjoyed by consumers everywhere. Harvesting honeydew pineapples is a careful process that requires precision. The journey from a sprouting plant to a ripe, juicy fruit is a fascinating one, but it's this final stage of the pineapple's life cycle where we, the farmers, have a crucial role to play. Firstly, let's talk about the tools of the trade. A clean, sharp knife is a must-have. Pineapples are sturdy fruits, but they require a delicate touch to avoid damaging the flesh underneath their tough exterior. Gloves are also essential, as the pineapple's skin can be prickly and sometimes cause irritation. A basket or crate lined with soft material will help protect the harvested fruits from getting bruised or damaged. Now, the key question is, how do we know when a pineapple is ready to be harvested. Well, there are a few telltale signs to look out for. The color of the pineapple is your first clue. A ripe honeydew pineapple will have a golden yellow color. However, color alone is not a foolproof indicator as pineapples can sometimes ripen unevenly. So we also rely on the smell. A ripe pineapple will have a sweet, fruity aroma at the base. The size of the pineapple is another good indicator. While pineapples can vary in size, a full-grown honeydew pineapple will typically be about a foot tall. Once we've identified a ripe pineapple, the harvesting process is straightforward. We use our sharp knife to cut the fruit from the plant, leaving about an inch of the stalk attached to the fruit. This helps to prevent rot and extends the fruit shelf life. Remember, a pineapple doesn't continue to ripen after it's been harvested. 
so it's essential to pick them at the right time. After harvesting, we handle each pineapple with care, placing them gently in our lined basket or crate. The fruits are then ready to be cleaned and sorted before they're packed up for the market. With the pineapples harvested, it's time to prepare them for the market. Moving on from pineapples, let's explore the world of bamboo shoots. Now, these aren't your typical garden vegetables. They're a unique crop with a fascinating life cycle that begins deep within the soil. First, let's start with planting. Bamboo is propagated from pieces of the rhizome, which is a type of underground stem. The rhizome is planted in well-draining soil, ideally in a sunny location. It's important to note that bamboo prefers acidic soil with a pH level between 5 and 6. Now, the growth of bamboo is where things get interesting. Bamboo grows differently than most plants. Instead of growing outward, bamboo grows upward. The bamboo shoot, which is the edible part of the plant, is the young, tender growth that emerges from the ground. After the rhizome is planted, it takes about two to three weeks for the first shoots to appear. These shoots grow rapidly, sometimes as much as three feet in a single day. Can you believe that? It's no wonder bamboo is considered one of the fastest growing plants in the world. As the bamboo matures, the shoots become harder and more fibrous, making them less desirable for culinary use. So, when are bamboo shoots ready to harvest, you might ask? Well, the ideal time to harvest bamboo shoots is when they're about 5 to 6 inches tall. At this stage, they're still tender and delicious. Harvesting bamboo shoots is a delicate process. The shoots must be carefully dug up to avoid damaging the rhizome which will continue to produce more shoots in the future. Once harvested, the shoots can be used fresh or preserved for later use. So, as you can see, the life cycle of bamboo shoots is a unique and intriguing process. It's a testament to the resilience and adaptability of nature, showing us that even the most humble plants have a lot to offer. Once the shoots are ready, it's time to harvest. And that, my friends, is the life cycle of bamboo shoots. Harvesting bamboo shoots is a unique process that differs significantly from harvesting pineapples. Bamboo shoots, a delightful addition to any Asian dish, are harvested in a distinctive way that requires a keen eye and a gentle hand. Let's dive into this fascinating process, shall we? First, we need to understand when a bamboo shoot is ready to be harvested. Unlike fruit-bearing plants, Bamboo's readiness isn't determined by color or size. Instead, we look for shoots that have just emerged from the ground, typically when they are about four to six inches tall. They will have a cone-like shape and a soft texture. This is when they're at their most tender and delicious. The tools used for this delicate operation are quite simple. A sturdy, sharp spade or shovel is all you need. The goal is to carefully dig around the shoot freeing it from the earth without damaging the tender flesh. Remember, bamboo is a grass and it can be quite resilient, but the shoots are fragile and can be easily bruised. Once you've exposed the base of the shoot, it's time to carefully lift it from the ground. Keep a firm grip on the shoot and gently lever it upwards with your spade. The goal is to keep the shoot intact, preserving its natural shape and texture. While the process may seem a tad labor-intensive, the reward is worth every bit of effort. Freshly harvested bamboo shoots have a delightful crunch and a subtly sweet flavor that's hard to resist. And of course, they're a highly sought-after commodity in many markets around the world. Proper handling post-harvest is also crucial. Bamboo shoots should be cleaned and stored in a cool place as soon as possible to maintain their freshness. Some prefer to blanch the shoots briefly before storing them, which can help to preserve their flavor and texture. With the bamboo shoots harvested, it's time to prepare them for the market. Our carefully harvested shoots are now ready to bring joy to the kitchens of many, adding a touch of exotic flavor to dishes around the globe. After harvesting, the next stage is to prepare the produce for the market. This is a crucial step where the fruits of our labor, quite literally, are readied for their journey from the farm to the consumer's table. First, it's all about cleanliness. 
our honeydew pineapples and bamboo shoots are thoroughly washed to remove any dirt or residue. Good hygiene is not just about aesthetics, it's also about health and safety. Next comes the packaging. The produce is carefully packed to minimize damage during transportation. We treat every piece as if it's the only one we're sending to market. Then we arrange for transportation. It's important to ensure that the journey is as smooth as possible to maintain the quality of the produce. Throughout these steps, maintaining product quality is our top priority. Good produce is the result of careful attention to every detail, from planting to harvesting and finally to market. And that's how honeydew pineapples and bamboo shoots are harvested and brought to the market.